Welcome back to the second part of the Easy Design video tutorials. Now we will start doing the layout. And in Easy Design you can either import information from a CAD file, but that I will show you later. For now I will show you how to create a scene or a layout manually. And all you do is you go up to the left portion of the screen and you will find a number of different tabs going from walls all the way to my objects and you're going to work from left to right so we're going to start by adding the wall sections of this layout of this room and you can draw one wall at a time you can draw four walls at a time and you can even use a room guide and I have a few templates you can download more templates and what you do is you type in the dimensions of each section and then you click make and it will create the room for you. For now I'm gonna click cancel and I'm gonna create a rectangular room and I'm gonna pick exterior wall. You can pick interior and exterior wall. Then I go out into the easy design grid and I find the zero zero point and you do that by looking at the ruler on top, the ruler on the left and you also have digital measurement on the bottom. I find a zero point, I press my left mouse and I move down to my right and it starts building out the room. And when I'm ready, I let go of the left mouse button and there you go, there are the walls. If I want to add an interior wall, I go to interior wall and I want to add one single wall section. So I click on single wall, I go out, I find the section where I want to start, press left mouse button and move and I can do one more directly. If you want to change one of the walls you've created you can click the arrow marker up to your left and then if I zoom in I grab with the, my left mouse one of the node sections, the circle sections and I can move it to where I want it to be. Now to zoom or move in the layout you use a mouse with a scrolling wheel and if I roll the scroll wheel, it moves away, or if I zoom the other way, it moves closer. To move, I press the scroll button, and I can move the layout wherever I want it. That was how you create the wall sections.